Hi, my name's Simon from Motodrome. Now today we're going to take a walk around and a drive of uh, this J registration, so uh, either 1970 or 71, uh, Land Rover Series 2A, 88 inch soft top you can see behind me. It's actually um, come back to its old stomping ground, so I've just looked through the MOT history and the first three MOTs were, uh, were carried out the garage not two miles down the road where I'm going to go in a minute. They do a lot of work for us. Um, so I expect they'll like to see it. Anyway, um, two videos, one walk around, one driving, plus a bit of engine running action at the end, starting and idling action at the end. Hope you like them. Okay, let's have a look around this uh, rather lovely, in my opinion. Um, very late as J registrations, either 1970 or 71. Uh, Land Rover Series 2A 88 inch petrol uh, with the Maltese, Maltese cross grille. Uh, finished in marine blue. Now, is the paint original? Um, I think on balance it probably is, having, uh, having polished it. Uh, obviously apart from the um, soft top tailgate which has been uh, fitted later and is, um, well it's marine blue but it's a very, very slightly darker shade. But I think the vast majority of the paint is, is original. Uh, if not all of it. It's actually a very, very local car to us, just looking through the MOT history for years in the early 70s. It was MOT'd at the garage not uh, not two miles from here that we uh, that do a lot of work for us these days. Um, she is lovely, she really is. So marine blue, black interior, full spec this one. It's got um, three wheel front hubs on it. Um, 20580 R16 tires on it uh, with a spare on the bonnet. It's got deluxe seats inside. It's got overdrive. Um, it's also got CB radio, though we haven't tested that. We have got the aerial for it if you want it. Uh, yeah, three deluxe seats, twin bench seats in the back. Uh, obviously we do have the hard top, which can come with it as well if you want, and the original height rear door. Full height rear door, should we say. It's got tow pack on it. Decent Michelin tyres all round. Oh, it's really nice. Mud flaps all round as well. Now we'll go around and pick out some good bits and bad bits. As I say, I think the paint on balance is, is original because you've got one or two marks on it here and there, like up here on the top of the, can't see because the shadow up here on top of the wing here. Uh, but it's, it's nicely patinated, shall we say. And a couple of marks down there not so much on that side she's beautifully straight though she really is if the paint isn't original it's been painted a long time ago should we say because it's nicely settled there's a couple of you can't really see them in this light but there's a couple of um, sort of swirl marks and stuff on the top of the um, near side front wing here but um, let's go underneath here show you Under there, and then around and up the A post. So a couple of bits of paint loss on the A post. Along the scuffle, hood's in good shape. One or two sort of small creases in it because it has been uh, sort of stored and, and bagged up. It's just come out and been put on. We've got a scratch down there on the near side modesty cover. Inside here, seats, we've got a tiny nick just on the passenger seat just there, otherwise the seats are in good shape. And in the back there, twin bench seats, no seat belts in the back, not a legal requirement in fairness. Uh, original steering wheel, original dash, I'll show you bulkhead corners there and into the footwell, get the mat out. Bit of a blemish just there, and just on the back of the near side rear wing there. Let's say all indicative of, of a car that is just over 50 years old really, and just been kept quite nice. I think it's had a rear cross member on at some stage, because that's the join line there. As 
I say, the, the paint on the um, on the drop down tailgate is, it is marine blue, but it's much newer paint, shall we say. Um, I don't know if you can see a colour difference on the video there, but there's a very, very faint difference, but you'd expect that. Back of the hood's all nice. The rear tail's so straight on it. I really like this. I like it to drive, I like driving it as well. It's, uh, it's very pleasant. More importantly than the outer wing, let's show you in here. Base of the driver's door. Side front wing, and again went under here. And then inside here. Let's see if we can get this mat out so you can see inside this foot well. So I think there we have it. I, <laughs> this really appeals to me, this one. It really does. Uh, anyway, my name's Simon. You can reach me in the office on 0118 907 1495. Or you can go to our website, which is www.moto-drome.com for any more info. All right, quick video of start up. Let's say all lighting mission light come on as they should. Starts really sweetly. And then here we have the little 2.25 8 to 1 compression ratio 3 bearing engine, which I think is the original. Certainly it's uh, period correct. Little carburetor. So it's running really, really nicely. It's also had an unleaded conversion. Do what it's supposed to do.